Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are going to be taking a look at major highlights from Barcelona financial audit. And we will also be looking at the transfer operation that destroyed FC Barcelona economy, along with Spain coach praise for La Masia star Gavi on his debut. All coming up on today, Barcelona Daily News, right here on Team FCB. Let's get things started with Barcelona CEO Ferran Revinto who revealed the club financial audit publicly earlier yesterday. The audit covered the financial account till the end of 2020-21 financial year and will now be presented to the General Assembly later this month. The big takeaway from the release was the fact that Barcelona ended the financial year with a revenue of 631 million euros well below the expected 828 million euros which represent minus 26 less than 855 million euros of the previous year. And without the impact of COVID-19 for 2020-21 season, the club will have been 390 million euros in debt either way. The most affected area in terms of loss of revenue has been the stadium which has made 25 million euros in revenue, negative 85% compared to the previous year. Well 282 million have been raised in media and TV right revenue. This was negative 14% down from the previous year as well. All in the end, the loss of 481 million euros in the 2020-21 financial year have led to negative balance of 451 million euros at the end of June in terms of net worth. Meanwhile, it has been a dream start to the new season for Barcelona prospect Gavi. Having managed to make an impression during the preseason, the 17-year-old forced his way into Ronald Koeman first team at the club. And without a doubt, he has been one of the biggest positives of the season so far for the Catalan giant, who have been blighted by issues on the field. The teenager's promising start to the new campaign was rewarded by Spanish manager Luis Enrique, who ended him a surprise call-up for the UEFA National League matches this month. What more? Enrique even ended him a start in a high-profile semi-final clash against Italy on Wednesday night. Safe to say that the midfielder did not disappoint and put in a fine all around display as La Roja ended Italy and beaten run to make it to the final. Gavi made a solid impression in the night with his work rate off the ball and his ability to carry the ball forward and make the line breaking passes. And in making his debut on Wednesday, Gavi became the youngest player ever to represent Spain at the age of 17 years and 62 days, breaking the record held by Angel Zubieta 17 years and 284 days since way way back in 1936. Despite the pressure of the Occasion, Gavi did not show any signs of nerves and was hailed by manager Enrique in the aftermath of the game. Next up, according to Sport, the signing of Antoine Griezmann in the summer of 2019 by Barcelona was an operation that very much ruined the club's economy. The 20-year-old Frenchman arrived at the Camp Nou from arch-rival Atletico two years ago in a deal worth a massive 120 million euros as Barcelona triggered his release clause, just 12 months after he had rejected the move in a controversial manner. Since Barcelona had to trigger his release clause, they had to pay the full amount at once and not settle it in installment. However, at the time, the Catalans were in no position to afford such a some at the one go and were forced to take two separate loans. Indeed, as per report, Barca took a credit of 85 million euros from an investment fund while borrowing another 35 million from a bank on a six month loan, which has since been repaid. In addition, his wages worth around 20 million euros a year were also a major burden on the club finances at a time when the revenue had been affected. And what was damaging was the fact that the investment never really looked like it was going to pay off as Griezmann hardly hit a top gear in his first two seasons at the club. All this contributed to Barca deciding to cut ties with him and floating him to Atletico Madrid in the summer earlier this year. The 30-year-old returned to his former club on a two-year loan deal with an obligation to make the transfer payment for a fee of 50 million euros. If you missed out in our previous video, check this video right here. And this is the Team FCB Barcelona Daily News. Thanks for watching everybody. And see you in the next video.